Salute family, it's Tank Commander Zulu and the Real Man Movement. You are now watching TV Savalas. To learn more about Tank Commander Zulu and the Real Man Movement, join me on YouTube at Tank Commander Zulu. And also follow me on IG at tank.commander.zulu. On Instagram, it's all about positive male enforcement. Fire in the hole, baby. Rock steady. This is the five month update of my hair locks, my locks. Um, just got my hair retwisted for the first time at a shop since um, November, the end of November-ish. Um, and I learned a lot since then. This is five months, of course, now. I started growing in October 2019. I, I got it first uh, twisted October 2nd, 2019. And this is, uh, what is this? March 18th, somewhere right there. We're like in that week. I think today's the 18th. Uh, we're in the middle of March, basically. And I haven't really seen the back. But there it is. <laughs> so I'm just going to share some things with y'all, what I learned. First of all, let me uh, show the product that she used on it or that I had bought for her is to uh, lock it up and so just a breakdown real quick of uh, my journey so far these five months well let me go back to the very beginning I started the last time I had a haircut was May 20th 2019 and the only reason I know that was because I got a haircut right before my graduation from uh, Merritt College and so that was on the 22nd and I had a haircut when I went into graduation and so ever since then, I haven't got a haircut. So it's been almost a year. I mean, growing my hair, actually. And then in October, I got my hair twisted. And then that was the beginning of October. And then October 13th, I got it retwisted. And I wouldn't recommend people to get their hair retwisted that early. But I did that because it was my anniversary and we were going to Hawaii. So if you go back and look at my other videos, my Hawaii trip, you can see that I had my hair twisted. Um, and that was a retwist. And then in the end of October, I have my hair twisted again. And that's when, after I had got it twisted again at the shop, um, it looked very beautiful. And I only used two people, but I used the lady I just came from, Miss Keisha. This is my third time using her out of the um, four times. I have another lady, but she's more like a backup lady. But anyway, oh. Let me uh, disclosure or let me uh, put this announcement out there about this uh, coronavirus pandemic that's going on right now. I hope you guys are safe. I hope none of your loved ones have been affected by this. And I hope you guys are taking precautions to stay safe. So, you know, uh, just do positive things, man. You know, wash your hands, take showers, um, take respiratory um, vitamins and, and herbs to help your uh, your lungs and your respiratory system in general. So take the herbs, man. Take herbs. Go Google, look up, get some shipments. Amazon, Amazon truck just passed my house. Amazon's still working. They still out here. So that's my disclaimer and uh, my uh, notice for y'all. Anyway, back to the locks. Um, and so I, uh, the beginning of December, I was looking up videos about locks and things like that and how to do it naturally and all this stuff, you know, uh, digging into my knowledge, going down the rabbit hole. And came across a lady she's from i think she's from jersey she's from the islands i believe but she lived in jersey and she also does work in atlanta and she's big on uh natural she's she's big on hair health and so um she just uses coconut oils to do her client's hair and she has uh, locks of her herself she has locks herself and she just uses coconut oil olive oil castor um oil right and even when she's doing the twist, the retwist and all that, uh, that's all she used as far as uh, putting products in hair. She doesn't use like the products that I show. Like, even though this is a, a natural, um, has a natural um, things in it, uh, like these roots and extracts and uh, rosemary and, and uh, nettle extract and all these type of things. Um, she just uses coconut oil, like I said, olive, olive oil and um, castor oil. So anyway, I was, uh, you know, listening to her videos and then 
I uh, I seen um, she not that she she doesn't care about style, right? She just cares about health. And so as far as like how to twist your hair, it's really not a big thing. But she was saying back in the islands um, that people did two strand twists uh, to start their their locks. And I was like, that makes sense. It'll lock quicker in most cases, right? And um, she had different videos. And so then, so what I did in December was I had my coil twist in, right, from the shop. And then I just separated them and I, I double strand twisted them, right? I don't know if you can, they're still double strand twisted, right? And so my hair, you'll see a before and after picture um, from my hair before. If you follow me on social media, you've seen how crazy my hair was from all the new growth. And, um, and so anyway, to fast forward to get to today, um, I get to the shop. She's like, you let your hair grow uh, too much before um, coming to see me. And I was like, oh, okay, well, you know, it is what it is. And so anyway, um, she was like, your hair has a hard time locking. I was like, yeah, I, it's, you know, a lot of it, not a lot of it, a lot of it wasn't locked, but um, even right now, some of it is, but some of it's not. A lot of it's still not locked and it's been uh, five months. But really, if you count December, it's only really been three months. So it depends on how you look at it, how you count it. Some of them are locked, some of them aren't. So anyway, she, uh, I believe she crocheted the roots of them. That's what it feels like. She had her little thing and pulling it, all that. So, um, you know, it feels nice and tight. It doesn't feel loose, you know what I mean? She didn't put too much uh, product in the hair. She didn't send me under a dryer. Um, those things that I, I prefer, right? I don't want to go under a dryer. One thing I learned from the lady that I was watching videos from is that, you know, you put all the chemicals in your head and they sit you under a dryer and it's just like, I don't want to go under a dryer. Um, I really don't want, I really didn't want to use that, but I use it just, just because, and I know, um, that's what I started with and that's what I've been using. Um, and I'll just in between, you know, I'll just use uh coconut oil to keep my scalp, uh, moisturized cleaned and and shiny and healthy um and castor oil to keep it castor oil to keep it moisturized and coconut oil to um just keep it healthy throughout the time and this is march so i really haven't planned i, re I really don't plan on getting retwisted again until april may june july august so I'm thinking the end of July, August time frame, about five months from now. That's when I'll probably do another video. And then after that, I know I'll, I'll get it twisted again in December before my birthday sometime. So um, just to check out the little length. I'm getting long, guys. I'm getting long. I'm getting long. You can see the, you can really see the double twist on that one. The two strand twist. Um, I'm happy with how it looks. I bought, um, this came from the beauty supply. I'll show you guys this. Normally I just wrap it up in a do-rag um, at night, but I just bought this. So hopefully this can help keep my hair, uh, you know, together for a while. Tea tree oil, coconut oil, real fit spandex cap, style to fit your life. Uh, of course, ultra stretchy, fits all sizes, keep tight. And I'll be using this probably mostly um, throughout the day. And then at night, I'll probably still use my do-rag. Um, premium collection by Titan. So once again, I have that. And um, so I'm excited to finally have my hair redid. So, uh, and hopefully, by my next video, I'll be hmm, down here instead of right here. Oh, I feel a little shake. Y'all see that? Oh, man. Y'all messing me up. Let me get in the house. All right. Thanks for watching. Thanks for uh, staying, staying tuned in. Don't forget to subscribe, like the video, share it. Um, and be looking forward to some more updates. If you guys have any suggestions about um locks please leave a comment below 
I love to learn more. If you have locks, if you don't have locks, if you used to have locks and you cut them or if you just started, please comment, let me know your journey. Um, please share tips about how to maintain locks. Um, I'm open to all suggestions and listening to everybody's comments. I appreciate it. Um, we'll see where it goes. Once again, this is month five, but uh, you can say month three, depending on how you look at it. But I, I originally got twisted back in October, like I said. I did the two strand in December. So it depends on how you look at it. And um, this is my journey, my lock journey. To all my natural people out there. Peace.